Hi, my name's Zoe Campbell and I'm from Devonport High School. We are here today at Andrew's Confectionery and we are going to be talking to Ange. Ange, what is your role here at Andrew's Confectionery? I'm the factory supervisor. Um, I have eight staff underneath me. Can you tell me a bit more about Andrew's? Okay, so Igor, he came to Australia from Belgium about 30 years ago. He set up Anvis Confectionery as a one-person job. He was a baker by night and wanted to start chocolate in Australia, a good quality chocolate. So he opened up his gar double garage under his house, turned it into a little factory where he made truffles by the daytime and baked at night. Um, as the business grew, he employed some more staff and we've been here now at Windara for about 14 years, so he progressed. He now has the cafe. Um, we have a retail shop out the front and we export pretty much all over Australia. What does a typical day look like? Um, for us, Zoe, it's, it depends on customer demand. Uh, it could be piping truffles, it could be making fudge. We do a range of pralines. Um, it just varies. What is your favourite part about working at Anvis Confectionery? Uh, I think it's the people. We have a great range of people from the kitchen right through to the cafe staff and uh, most would say eating the chocolate. What are some of the opportunities and benefits of working here that people may not realise? I guess for us it's the training. Uh, Igor, our boss, is strongly strong believer of training and he puts everybody through their certificates. So everyone's trained to certificate three in whatever department they're in. Some of them have done certificate four and I've actually done my diploma. What got you interested in working at Anvers? Uh, for me it was, I wanted a job when I left school so this opportunity came up um, and I've been here for 24 years since so obviously it's a good place to work and I enjoy what I do. Who is suited to something like this? I guess anybody is suited to a job like this. Um, as long as you have the passion and I mean everybody likes chocolate so for us, um, we just look for people that you know are keen, eager and like to have some fun. For someone wanting to get into being a supervisor, what pathways should they take? Well, for us here at Anvers, it's all about the training and the right attitude again. Um, people skills are fantastic, so we just progress through the ranks really and you've just got to grab the opportunity when you can, when it comes up. But the training's very important, like extra schooling. Um, with our staff today we look for minimum year 11 and 12 um, but the main points are a good work ethic, um, a, the right attitude um, and the willingness to learn and all the other training is provided on the job.